Welcome back. Hi, we missed you. You look great. Oh. Today we'll be discussing your 30s. Living with pride and dignity in a third decade of life. Your dirty 30s. Thirty flirties. Tur I don't know anything else that rhymes. I think you could say turkey. I think you could get turkey away. Turkey thirties. <laughs> Partner, as someone approaching my 30s, I think about new fears. You're scared, but you need new reasons why. <laughs> um, what are you afraid of? Uh, men who tell you they can give you a job, and then it turns out it was your dad. Sometimes I fear I'm going to get cut. From the team? Skin. Mm. Slashed right on the street. I got another fear. Uh, hepatitis D. If you're already in your 30s, why don't you comment right now? Just whenever we get one right, just say right in the comments. And if you're already scared, great. Crane comes, knocks you unconscious, nobody cares. Jeans. Skirts. Pardon, was that jeans or skirts or jean skirts? Jeans skirts. You said jeans skirts. Do you mean jeans skirts or jean skirts? Jean skirts. What, jeans, comma, skirts? Jeans, skirts, or jean skirts? Jeans are skirts! This is pretty scary. If you get too scared, you can always click on this other thing that'll get you feeling good. Let's click here. Click right here. Over there. Come on, come on. There you go. Come on, come on, That's click a boy. Here. Come on. Over there. Come on. Yep, you're really close. Come on, click. Oh, click here. One thing I think about is balancing career and family. Uh, I do. Okay, fine. Well, it's your body and your life. And when you're in your 30s, your body is changing. In a lot of ways, and none of them in the way you want them to be. None of them in the way you want them to be. None of them in the way you want them to be. None of them in the way you want them to be. So, uh, there's gonna be a lot of things that are gonna go wrong with your body. Okay. Your ankles are gonna get super round. Your knees, when you're young, they're rubbery, and as you get older, they're gonna feel more like plastic. Your scent is gonna change. First it was like a, more of like a fresh mountain, and now it's kind of more of fanatic. But you can fit most of your torso in your underpants. You also become white. Very white, very white. But it's good. People treat you nice. Oh, for sure. Another thing that's great in your 30s is career advancement. A lot of times people who have been working for their 20s and teens become successful in their 30s. For example, let's say you spend your 20s being a mother. You could be a grandmother. If you spent your 20s being a manicurist. You could be a mannequin. If you spent your 20s in medical school. You could be a medical school. Babysitting. You could be a babysitter. Trying to be an actress. You could be a drugs. Designing fashion concepts for Old Navy. You could be fired. If you spend your 20s teaching fifth graders. Then you better let the fifth graders start teaching you. If you spend your 20s collecting stamps. Then you better mail some letters because fuck, you cannot waste your time anymore. If you spend your 20s sweeping up hair in a hair salon, then you better make some dolls. If you spend your 20s monitoring websites for illegal or fraudulent activity, then congratulations, you're Mr. Robot on USA. You're out of your damn mind. USA! USA! Well, today we talked about your 30s. We talked about growing up, growing out, and growing on. Growing left, growing right. Life's daily crossword. You might not know all the words, but you can still fill up the squares completely black so no one else can do it. Take care for more. Take care for more. Take care for more. Click here. <laughs>